first video and um, I received some cash envelope like binders and new cash envelopes to replace my old ones. I was doing cash envelopes for a while and I got out of it. Um, but I want to get back into it because when I was doing cash envelopes, I was really able to like stick to my budget and I was able to save. Um, and it was also motivating just to see the actual physical cash. So I wanted to get back into it and I just wanted to share on video me setting up my binders and then also moving the cash from here into my new envelopes. There's not much money, but you know, whatever is there will move over. I decided to start this channel to kind of get me motivated um, and hold myself accountable. Um, so if you guys would like to join me on this journey, then please like and subscribe and you know, I'm happy you're here. Um, okay, so these are my old envelopes. I just ordered these off Amazon and then I also had to just use some regular envelopes because there wasn't enough. So I ordered these binders off Amazon. I'll have them linked in the description. Um, and then these, these envelopes, did I say? I had these binders, ordered these off Amazon and these envelopes off Etsy. But they're really cute. Um, one did come and it wasn't cut all the way. So I'll have to try to take some scissors and cut that open and hopefully that's not a problem. But I have self care. I have him, which is my boyfriend. I have mom, which is for my mom, obviously. Kitties. Fun. Wardrobe. Miscellaneous. And then I just have a blank envelope here because I wasn't really sure what else I wanted, but I thought an extra envelope would be good. And I already messed up because I ordered these two envelopes without the hole punches so they could fit in my wallet, but I forgot to order a grocery envelope. <laughs> like that's the main thing, um, or one of the main things. But this is this binder. And I love these binders. They're very smooth and soft. And I love these colors. Like they're just very, very pretty. So this binder is going to be for my bigger ticket item, my longer term savings goals. Like I have this gifts envelope. This is for Christmas and like birthdays and whatever else. I didn't want to have to deal with like two different um, envelopes for that. And then vacation. Medical. Car. Tech. This is for like a new laptop or something like that. I just recently got a new phone, so I won't need that. <clears throat> House, emergency fund. I do have a fully funded emergency fund. Um, and I will be stuffing placeholders in that envelope. And then I have my one month ahead envelope. And then I also, again, just have an empty envelope. And again, I somehow forgot to include a utilities envelope because that's the only bill that I pay in cash. So I don't know how I forgot that envelope and groceries. Those are like the two main like revolving cash envelope. I don't know how I forgot that. Um, but let's go ahead and fill these with whatever we have. And I apologize about the lighting. I hope it's okay. I'm still trying to figure this out. This is my first, you know, YouTube video. So I'm still learning. Um, but yeah, these envelopes I had off Amazon. And as you can see, they're kind of tearing. 
So in my personal envelope, which is now her, and I just thought that was cute, her and then him. But I have five, six, seven dollars. And these will go in my wallet. Eat out, I have nothing. And those budget sheets in there don't fit in these envelopes, so I'll just have to um, make new ones. But these will fit perfectly in here. I didn't want to have to buy a new wallet because I just bought this one and I really like it and I didn't want to not use it. So, and I'll put the groceries on this side. And then once I get an envelope, I'll put it in there for that. Okay, so my self-care, I believe was in this binder, yes. All right, so for my self-care, I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15, 16, 17. 117, 4 kitties, I don't think I have anything, we just recently bought them food, yeah, so nothing in there, for mom, she has $5, For him, my boyfriend, he also has $5. And this is the one, it did not get cut properly, so I'll have to take scissors to it. Hopefully, I'll be able to cut it straight because I don't have, you know, one of those um, long, you know, cutters. I, I can't think of the word. Um, wardrobe, I don't believe had anything, no. Fun, also nothing. We don't have fun around here, guys. It's always serious. Just kidding. All right, and nothing in gifts, so that was all that I had. Okay. And I just really like these binders and envelopes. They just kind of elevate my cash envelope game. And I don't know, I just feel like when I see these, it kind of motivates me more versus like these old worn out ones. It's kind of like, eh, you know. All right, so for house, I have 20. Now we are hoping and praying for down payment so that's what we're working towards and then 10 15 16 17 18 19 dollars and that was for tech and this is for I don't know if I've said this already but for like a laptop yes I did say that because I said I just got my phone recently okay and then for car I don't know if there's anything yeah there's a $10 bill for car. And these tins are so worn out, they just don't want to go in there. Medical has 10. Vacation has. 15. Gifts has 10, 15, 20. And as this is December 7th, I really need to step up my game. I have one gift already like bought and shipped so I just need to get a few more um for my emergency fund let me grab these I got some of these placeholders 
um, off Amazon. I will also have those linked below. But I do have a fully funded emergency fund in my savings account, so we'll put 10,000 of these in there. $10,000 in there. So 1,000, 2,000, 3, 4, 5. Oh, I'm out of frame. Let's try that again. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, thousand. And how satisfying is that? Before with like these, if I needed to have a placeholder or anything, I would just use like a scrap piece of paper and write the amount. And I mean, it worked, especially if you're on like a tight budget and you don't want to spend, I can't remember how much this bundle of placeholder money was. Um, but I think it was like $10, but you know, $10 is a lot to a lot of people. I mean, that's a lot to me, $10. That's a whole meal, but, um, it just wasn't as motivating to see that, but to see this, like that looks good. I want all of my envelopes to look like that. All right. But anyway, these are my cash envelope binders. I'm in love. I really like these. I'm glad to get, you know, something a little more elevated than these. I mean, they served a purpose and they worked fine for what they did. So, you know, I'm thankful for that, but I'm really excited to just go on this journey with a fresh new cash envelope binder. And I'm excited for you guys to join me as well. Um, like I said, I've kind of created this YouTube channel to hold myself accountable to really make sure I stick on budget. Um, my next video, I don't know if I will be uploading that today or tomorrow as well, but it will be my paycheck budget plan. And if you guys would like to see that, then just subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. And um, make sure to like this video. It really helps me out. Thank you, guys.